Hello everyone, today we're diving deep into a topic that's close to my heart kidney health. Your kidneys are these amazing little filters that work tirelessly to keep your body in tip-top shape. They remove waste products, balance fluids, and even help regulate your blood pressure. Now, just like any other organ, your kidneys thrive on a healthy lifestyle. That's why I'm so excited to share some essential dietary tips that can make a world of difference. We'll be talking about specific foods that you might want to avoid or limit if you're looking to keep those kidneys happy. Remember, taking care of your kidneys is a marathon, not a sprint, and making small, sustainable changes to your diet can have a huge impact on your long-term health, so let's get started. First up, let's talk about processed meats. We're talking about your bacon, sausages, and deli meats. Now I know they're tasty, but they're often loaded with sodium and phosphorus additives, which can put extra stress on your kidneys. Remember, moderation is key. If you're craving meat, opt for lean, organic options and cook them at home so you can control the ingredients. Next on our list is something many of us enjoy a little too much soda. Those sugary drinks might seem harmless, but that high sugar content and phosphoric acid can really take a toll on your kidneys over time. Remember, staying hydrated is crucial, so stick to water, herbal teas, or infused water for a refreshing and kidney-friendly alternative. Now let's talk about dairy products. While they can be a good source of calcium, they're also high in phosphorus, which can be problematic for those with kidney issues. The good news is there are so many plant-based alternatives available these days. Almond milk, soy milk, or even oat milk can be great substitutes for your morning cereal or coffee. Canned foods, while convenient, often come with a hidden cost-high sodium content. Sodium is used to preserve these foods, but it can put a strain on your kidneys. Whenever possible, opt for fresh or frozen alternatives, and always check those nutrition labels. Let's talk about white bread. It's a staple in many diets, but its high glycemic index can lead to spikes in blood sugar, which can be harmful to your kidneys over time. Choose whole grain bread whenever possible. It's packed with fiber and nutrients and has a lower impact on your blood sugar levels. Bananas, while a great source of potassium, can be tricky for those with kidney issues. High potassium levels can be risky for people with compromised kidney function. Don't worry, there are plenty of other delicious and nutritious fruits out there. Apples, berries, and grapes are all lower in potassium and equally delicious. Tomatoes, like bananas, are packed with nutrients but also contain potassium. If you're watching your potassium intake, you might want to moderate your tomato consumption. The good news is there are plenty of delicious alternatives. Bell peppers, cucumbers, and onions can add flavor and nutrition to your meals without the extra potassium. Oranges and orange juice are known for their vitamin C, but they also pack a punch of potassium. If you're watching your potassium levels, you might want to enjoy these in moderation. Remember, variety is key to a balanced diet. Explore other fruits like grapes, apples, or pears for a refreshing and lower potassium treat. Let's be honest, who doesn't love a good bag of chips? But those salty and crunchy snacks are loaded with sodium and unhealthy fats, both of which can put a strain on your kidneys. Instead of reaching for those chips, opt for healthier snack options like air-popped popcorn, unsalted nuts, or veggie sticks with hummus. Peanuts, while a good source of protein, are also high in phosphorus. If you're watching your phosphorus intake, you might want to enjoy these in moderation. Luckily, there are plenty of other delicious nuts out there. Almonds, cashews, and walnuts are all lower in phosphorus and make for a satisfying and kidney-friendly snack. Now let's talk about everyone's favorite treat, chocolate. While dark chocolate with a higher cocoa content can actually be beneficial for your health, milk chocolate and white chocolate are high in sugars and phosphates, which can be problematic for your kidneys. Remember, moderation is key. If you're craving chocolate, opt for a small piece of dark chocolate with a high cocoa content, 70% or higher, for a healthier indulgence. Coffee is a staple in many morning routines, but excessive consumption can potentially impact kidney health. While moderate coffee intake is generally considered safe, it's important to be mindful of your consumption, especially if you have pre-existing kidney conditions. Listen to your body and stay hydrated. Consider limiting your intake or opting for decaffeinated coffee if you're concerned about the potential impact on your kidneys. Salted snacks, from pretzels to crackers, can be a major source of sodium in our diets. Excess sodium intake can lead to water retention and put a strain on your kidneys. Remember, reading food labels is your superpower. Opt for unsalted snacks or better yet, Make your own snacks at home where you can control the ingredients. Avocados, while incredibly nutritious, are also relatively high in potassium, 
If you're watching your potassium intake, you might want to moderate your avocado consumption. Don't worry, there are plenty of other delicious and healthy fats you can enjoy. Peaches, pineapples, and berries are all lower in potassium and make for a refreshing and nutritious snack. Dried fruits, while convenient, are essentially concentrated versions of their fresh counterparts. This means they pack a punch of sugar and potassium, which can be problematic for those watching their kidney health. Fresh is always best. Opt for fresh fruits whenever possible to satisfy your sweet tooth and get your daily dose of vitamins and minerals. Brown rice is a nutritious whole grain, but it does contain higher levels of potassium compared to white rice. If you're watching your potassium intake, you might want to be mindful of your portion sizes. Remember, variety is key. Explore other grains like quinoa, bulgur, or barley, which are all lower in potassium and offer unique flavors and textures to your meals. Spinach, while a nutritional powerhouse, is also high in potassium and oxalates. Oxalates can contribute to kidney stone formation, so it's important to be mindful of your intake, especially if you're prone to kidney stones. Don't worry, there are plenty of other leafy greens to enjoy. Lettuce, kale, and arugula are all lower in oxalates and make for a delicious and nutritious addition to your meals. Sweet potatoes, while a delicious and nutritious root vegetable, are relatively high in potassium. If you're watching your potassium intake, you might want to enjoy these in moderation. Remember, balance is key. Cauliflower, broccoli, and white potatoes, in moderation, are all lower in potassium and can be enjoyed as part of a healthy diet. Pickles, while a delicious and tangy treat, are often high in sodium due to the brining process. Excess sodium can put a strain on your kidneys and lead to water retention. Why not try making your own? A refreshing cucumber salad with a light vinaigrette dressing can be a delicious and lower sodium alternative to pickles. Tomato sauce, a staple in many kitchens, can be surprisingly high in potassium and sodium. If you're watching your intake of these nutrients, you might want to be mindful of your tomato sauce consumption. Fresh is best. Making your own tomato sauce at home with fresh tomatoes and herbs allows you to control the ingredients and reduce the sodium content. Beer, like all alcoholic beverages, can affect kidney function, especially when consumed in excess. Alcohol can dehydrate you, which can put a strain on your kidneys. Remember, moderation is key. If you choose to drink alcohol, do so responsibly and stay hydrated by drinking plenty of water. Artificial sweeteners are often used as a sugar substitute, but their impact on kidney health is a topic of ongoing research and debate. Some studies suggest potential risks associated with excessive consumption. When it comes to sweeteners, natural is often best. Consider using natural sweeteners like stevia or honey in moderation to add a touch of sweetness to your meals and beverages. So there you have it. 22 foods that you might want to avoid or limit if you're looking to keep those kidneys happy and healthy. Remember, taking care of your kidneys is all about making small, sustainable changes to your lifestyle. It's always a good idea to consult with your healthcare provider or a registered dietitian for personalized advice tailored to your specific health needs. They can help you create a balanced and kidney-friendly meal plan that fits your lifestyle. Don't forget to subscribe my channel, Healthcare Tips by Alina. Stay healthy and take care.